International Human Rights Day, emphasizing that vow is a form of human rights violation. Since then, we have reached several milestones through the hard work and perseverance of advocates from the government, private, and civil society organizations, as well as the victim survivors themselves. The campaign became instrumental in calling for the passage of anti-vow laws, including the Anti-Trafficking in Persons Act of 2003, the Anti-Violence Against Women and Their Children Act of 2004, among others. I would like to congratulate and commend the Philippine Commission on Women for leading the annual observance of the 18-day campaign to end violence against women. I believe that each of us can do something to make a difference, no matter how big or small, as long as we work together to end violence against women and, of course, the girls. Let's intensify and continue our advocacy and push for a whole foundation approach to ensure that women and girls in our society are safe wherever they go, empowered, and have access to information and social protection services. On behalf of the Philippine Commission on Women and the Interagency Inter Council on VAUSI, I officially welcome you to the 2022 18-day campaign to end VAU kick-off ceremony. Beginning today, let us all stand united for a VAU-free Philippines. Thank you very much.